Sure, why not? <laughs> So I'm not like super entirely sure if I'm actually up right now. Alright, so I hope you all enjoyed that. That was... that's the plot. This is Trip World. And I'm just so very happy that you all can join me here for Trip World. Because this is... Trip World here is just... it's a lovely game. It's a nice, lovely game where you play as... he plays this bunny guy. He's cute. Look at him. So, bunny guy is kind of cool because he can... he can do this. He can turn into a, a flying bunny. Or... You can go back to uh, bunny or turn to fish. Yes, fish. But we're just going to stick with flying mode. Because uh, it's just, it's a nice form. Every, everything's nice in this game. Every Everyone's friendly. Everything's cute. And we're just, you know, we're just flying over the whole level. Because why not? I mean, none of us really came here to see a whole game. We just, we're just here for a good, nice cause. Or I could get sabotaged by a rodent. So with flight mode, there are some kind of limitations with it. I can't change directions once I start flying. So that's kind of why it's, it's pretty okay with this level since all I have to do is go from left screen to right screen, but you can't change direction mid-flight. Uh, if you try, you like spiral out there, so I'm going to turn back into bunny form because right here, we're going to use fish. Yeah. Alright, back we go. So this game was made by Sunsoft, which uh, not a lot of people know a lot of the games they made, but they always made great NES games. Uh, they made the Batman game. They also made the ever-difficult Mr. Gimmick game. But this one was just on the Game Boy. You know, just a nice, calm, easy game that have boss fights where... Uh, Bunny form tends to be your main attacking form because you can kick. And and there you go. B boss over. You know, just a, a nice, nice easy boss. Nice easy boss, nice easy game. Happy games, only only happiness with this game. And now, because we ate grapes, we're in ball form. What does ball form do? We bounce. We, we just happily bounce along. That's what happens, man. Aww. Uh, so I messed up. Uh, normally you can skip getting the fruit there. That turns you tiny, but now look at us! We're so adorable! Also look how easy this game is. Like Enemies don't even hurt you half the time. You can just walk right into them, bump into them, have friendly chit-chats, kick them, whatever. No one matters. It doesn't matter. Even look at, look at this guy. In a normal video game, he would be damaging the heck out of me, but no. Now, now, now he's my brother. Right? Now he's my brother and I love him. But we're going to leave him. Bye. You also may notice that the level kind of changed there drastically. We were in the jungle. Now we're in this tomb level. This game doesn't have a lot of levels just because it's such a, such a nice little game that it only has about five levels. But each level tends to have about two areas two themes and you'll you're, you're gonna see that they can they can contrast pretty pretty harshly but that's okay because this is this is still just a nice nice game a nice game about kicking enemies 
who use their uh, their electrified midsections to damage you. But it's okay. You know, it's all right. Because so long as we just keep kicking him, it doesn't even matter if he hits us. We inflict more damage than he inflicts to us. Hopefully. Or I could die. That works too. Get double hits. Normally if I can get three kicks in a cycle. Ooh. How about that? Ah, ah. There we go. Boss done. Hello, Steven. World 3. Yes. How may I help you? I, c I can hear you. Hello. Alright, so, we've been using a lot of uh, flight mode, and a lot of bunny mode, but now that we see this ocean, you probably think that the right answer is, is fish, but it's not. It's, it's actually more flight mode by water. Oh, is the game quiet? I can I can fix these things. Here you go, friends. That might be too much, but it's all I got. But look, now fish is useful. In terms of, huh? So like, there's just no desktop audio. I gotcha. I see. I see. Mm. Should I just? So you say just keep going? Oh no, I got hit. Hopefully, I can survive this boss. It is a shame because. This game's music is <laughs> its too good. All right, so you gotta walk away so that he gets unshy, opens up, and then once he opens up, you damage him emotionally. But but sometimes he can kill you. It's weird. The bosses in this game are all really really easy, except for two. There are two bosses in this game that are. Difficult. This one, and then the, another one that's like right at the very end. And it's kind of lame. There we go. But the level is not over. Now we fall. We fall to. We tumble and roll. But we turn back into fish. Uh. Sorry about that. I'm just trying to beat the game quickly. It's a fast game anyways. Okay. Alright. So we're going to get that. Just to get some health. And we're just going to keep jumping. Jump, jump. I do this as bunny form. Because with flying form it can sometimes be a little difficult. And here we see the field. Where Lucas meets his dead parents or something. I don't know. I don't play mother. Boss fight. Alright, boss over and done. Cool. World 4. Uh, we're just going to fly over it. Easy peasy. We'll just turn back into bunny form. Then we'll go into fly form, fly over. More of this level. Turn back into bunny form. So yes, yeah, so we go from that whole uh, cake level to factory level. Because sure, why not? 
Dang it. And just going to make sure I get over here. All right, so when I fall down here, I'm going to make sure I grab this fruit because this is going to turn me into Meryl so that I can kill enemies with my chain whip tail. And uh, this cake guy is kind of annoying because if you get too close to him, he ducks away. So you want to make sure you take care of him with the tail whip. And if you still have Meryl form when you get that fruit, you get this guy with really long legs. But it's okay because... Check this shit out. Physics! And if you're able to get to the boss with that form, you can take it down in one hit. Because why not? <laughs> Alrighty, kids, last level. Fish. Alright. So the final level is, uh, it's, it's flowers. It's, it's just a meadow. It's all it is, guys. Hop and fly. Just gonna keep flying over. Oops. I'm not gonna grab these grapes, but, uh, you know, we went from that flower to castle level. I kind of really, really do wish I had the music playing so you guys could hear how completely abrupt the music shift is. But yeah, by falling down there, we can just sneak into the castle by water. And I'm actually going to, well, for one, skip that guy because that's not important. But I'm going to stick around here. No, no. There we go. And I'm going to fight this guy a few times because this game is so basic that they have this enemy who drops free lives because he's meant to be like a mini boss or whatever. But you can come here and uh, you can just fight him repeated times to get more free lives. And you can kind of cheese it in that little spot. He can't hit you. It's super easy. I'm going to try and get about 8 lives because, as I said, there is another boss in this game that's annoying and difficult. And I'm going to need more than just a few lives. So I'm going to make sure I farm plenty of lives in my little cheese corner. Just kick it. While utilizing fly form. Ah! I guess it, sometimes fly form doesn't always want to work. Like I said, that whole only going in one direction. But there we go. I'm just going to make sure I get plenty of lives. Because this game is so short that if you game over, you go all the way to the beginning. But, I mean, I'm at the last level, so you can kind of see how that's not the worst thing ever. But still, that would more than double the time I've already been playing this game. And with no sound, no thank you. So, this will be the last one I get. Hopefully I don't need all of these. I mean, I'm going to die at least once because uh, I have damage. And the bosses coming up kind of need to be full health. There we go. So we're going to go in this factory setting. Going to sneak between here. Jump up. And there we go. And now we're pretty much done with the level. We got one more screen of enemies that we're going to, of course, fly over. So I'll just move along. Forget the robot. And here we go. We are at the final bosses. First we fight the king, but it's not the king, it's these twins. And all you gotta do is just, you know, kick them while not letting yourself get kicked. I got kicked, so I, I lost. There you go, so just some advice for you guys. Don't get kicked. But we're just gonna let this boss load up. 
Alright, so we took care of one, and we took care of the other. Now comes for the hard boss. This one... I fucking hate this boss. So it's it's a it's an evil clone, you know, a uh, a Crash Man to whatever Trip World's characters Mega Man is. Ah, no, don't hurt me, don't hurt me. Oh sweet, so when he starts doing this move, this is when he knows like he's towards the end. So hooray, I killed him. And now we have a Mega Man boss. That honestly guys, the music here is really great too. I'm I'm so sorry that the music's not playing, but I only got thirty minutes for this game. So we're just gonna get through it. And who knows, maybe you'll just see this later on the FTCR channel. And there you go, the boss is easily taken down with a few kicks. And that is Trip World. Sans sound. I apologize for that. But uh, as you can see, it's a short, easy, fun game. It's really fun. It's really cute. Honestly, I'm really surprised we haven't gotten another Trip World anything at all. Like, come on. This shit's too adorable to pass up. But there you go. I don't know. So yeah, in this game, this game that came out in the 90s on a Game Boy, the flower is the bad guy. So, someone wanna, someone explain to me how uh, a certain other game is original and fun and not a steamy hot pile of dog shit. But yeah, it looks like the king is like still dead, even though his evil flower has left him. Oh, no, it's right there. It's it's still there. It's it's still fucking looking at me. It's, bye. <laughs> and I think that's it. It's just going to roll a few credits. Oh, yeah. It, it holds on this screen for way too long, so we're just going to cut the stream now. Thanks for watching. That was Trip World. I love you all. Goodbye.